Welcome back to this awful monstrosity of a game. Andy and Lele, I can't I believe. What about. This is a masterpiece. This is a masterpiece of cinema uh, of gaming history. <sighs> is she making you do this? I mean, no. Are you going to kill us? Come on, of course not. Technically, anyway. <laughs> what is this? What is all this witchcraft looking nonsense? Just let her scare you a little. Leave you alone after that. How about it? Hmm. It's hard to say whether she believes you or not. I don't believe him. Hi, Dad. Your father doesn't have anything to say. He has always been like that, just going along with your mother's whims. Mm. It hits you then that you are just like him. God damn it. This buff is incredible! Oh, really? There was something I tried to talk to you about earlier. I don't really care, honestly. About Ashley. What is it? I wanted to apologize to you. I was making you look after her. That was wrong with me. It's fine. Can you imagine what it was like me back then? When I was your age, I was already, st I was already stuck with a seven and a five year old to care for. Think you'd have fared better than me? I wouldn't know. This is an excuse, mind you. It's an explanation. I never hated you. I was just a fuck up. Don't say that, honey. We did fine. He looks so ha! fine. So fine. Look where we are right now. Yeah. Anyway, you were such a nice child. I thought we might have just been fine having another. I wasn't counting on Ashley to be so. I'm sorry I made you raise her. I thought you were getting along, so I didn't see. What, I didn't want to see what was happening. If that, I apologize. It's not my fault. I apologize. Well, it is what it is. It doesn't have to be. I think we could still sort this out. Is that right? If it's money you need, I can help you get a job. They're hiring at your company, aren't they, Liv? That's right. If I put in a good word for you, you're good as hired. Before one, though, they get a lot of difficult customers there. But I know you can handle it. Should be easy after all. After handling Ashley all this time. What do you say? Parents are offering you an olive Maybe branch. I'm... Except. <sighs> okay. Sigh. I want to say yes. I wish I could say yes to that, honestly. But... I can't. I'm stuck. I'm so fucking stuck, you don't even know. Is it the death certificates? I noticed you had moved them. There must be some ugly mixer. We could get that. We could clear that up. There's a lot more to it than that. We ate somebody. <laughs> nothing, nothing has happened that can't be fixed, Andrew. And I'm not angry. I know you didn't want to do this. All you have to do is convince Ashley to give us the, to give you the gun. We'll just put this behind us. Fuck this. I need to light the candles. Alright. I can make this work. We're gonna be just fine. I think this is just an illusion of choice. Yeah. All Ashley needs to do is stop being such an unrelenting cut. We'll be fine. We're gonna be fine. Andrew. <laughs> Andrew. You'll get the government, right? I'm back! Great, the ritual is ready. I can't even get a proper hello. Can you just summon the damn thing? What's wrong? Everything. We just get it to it, goddammit. Sheesh. You are Ashley. Find the nearest oh. cliff. Great. Ahem. Oh, hello, hello, Mr. or Miss Demon. 
<laughs> I'm so sorry I don't have the mood music for you, but uh, the other stuff you asked for, there's no answer. You have to have the music, don't you? Maybe if I sung something. Please don't. Mercifully, the demon showed up to spare everyone the secondhand embarrassment. I see. Ah! <laughs> Tarso. His, I think he was the nerd. They do Tarso. What the fuck is that? Oh, yo. I offer these two. Their screaming is short lived as the demon steals their souls. Huh, I wonder if I should feel something. Well, anyway, so the music wasn't needed to summon you after all. I had to play it last time then. The circle is hard to find. The sound is easy to follow. However, you have my, my you have my talus, but now it makes you easy to find. Speaking of which, a deal's a deal. Charge it up, please. Your trinket works again. Thank you. What? what? Hello. This is the brother. Yep, the one and only. He may not be very useful, nor is he particularly loyal, but. But nothing, actually. Honestly, I don't even know why I keep him around. I see. Farewell, Tussle. Until you have another soul to offer. Right, thank you, and uh, bye-bye. The entity leaves. I don't know why I keep you around, either. I guess you're just stuck with me, aren't you? So stuck you don't even fucking know. Ah, an eavesdropper. Ah, that that's why. And you must and you've misunderstood. I meant our situation. Sure you did, for sure. Ashley. It doesn't matter now. Ashley, I picked you. I don't want to talk. Come on. Okay. Done. What are we gonna do about bodies? Ashley, I the bodies, Andrew. Focus. Right, the bodies. Uh, well, on one hand, we didn't kill them. Well, on the other hand, having them having gone missing would definitely be better for us. Maybe they just fucked off somewhere. Who knows? Meanwhile, there's a murder investigation. Right, so let's make them disappear. Right. We can't start. We can start by chopping them up. Yeah. Can we just dump them in the ocean or something? No, Ashley, I'm going to make them vanish, not wash up ashore somewhere. Are they going to sulfuric acid or something? Ugh, how can we go? How to go about this? Uh, Can't even leave a mess behind. Well, there's a drain right there. Right, you are. Andrew is untidy. It's untying the parents, but stops. The mom is still alive. Wait, what? What is it? Is that breathing? Take a look. Sure enough, his what? chest is moving ever so slightly. What? Ah, he is Bob too. You tried various things, but nothing gets response from your parents. If their hearts still beat, their long straw air. Oh God, what is this? Maybe losing your soul just turns you into a vegetable. That can't be. The cultist died, and the warden too. Well, I mean, did you actually check? Oh my god. Oops. I sure didn't. I just went to town and started chopping. Oh my god. <laughs> no, no, no. Please tell me he wasn't alive when we still ate him. He still wasn't alive. Oh god. <laughs> what the fuck is so funny about this? Come on now. I'm sure he died pretty quickly from blood loss. If not, you ripped his head off. Must have done the trick. It'll be the same with these two. Get the cotton. I hate everything about this. Mm -hmm. No, that this changes everything, doesn't it? You want to leave them like this? They're not getting their souls back. Though, if you want to leave them to starve, I'm all for it. Wouldn't it be a little too poetic? I'm sure you'd like that. Uh, I don't know. I need to think. Ah, oh, come I on. I mean, technically, if they going? just if they just left the parents in their beds and they're alive. Then they could have just starved in their bed. Like nothing happened. Yeah, no one just, killed them. They just died in, in their bed. Yeah. Oh, Andrew, look, look here for a second.
Oh. oh. You get your father too. What? What are you doing? There, all dead. Now tell me again how I always make you do all the dirty work. Huh? He'll bitch and bone. Surely he'll bitch and bone as per usual. But you did not miss that sigh of relief. Anyway, you drag your parents' soulless and lifeless bodies over to the shower. Okay. All right, I'll start cutting. You guide the blood into the drain with the shower head. Gotcha. Whoa, whoa, what? Stop, stop. Stop, it's flooding. Huh? Ah, oh, what the hell? Gross. Ah, oh, great. The drain is clogged up. Ew. And the lid is screwed shut. I need a screwdriver. Oh, good thing there's a thing of screwdrivers right there. Yep. You just keep chopping the bodies. I'll get you something to unclog the drain with. Screw, screw the, the The toolbox, Nathan? Screwdriver. Got it. How do you unclog this thing anyway? After we unscrew the lid, we can pour down some baking soda and vinegar down the drain. Uh, here? Maybe? Baking soda and vinegar. 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 Baking soda's and upstairs. Then, yeah. Wait, wouldn't it be the opposite? Why would vinegar be in the basement and baking soda in the kitchen? It's cleaning and baking soda's for baking. You can also use baking cleaning? soda. Yeah, you can use vinegar to clean. I thought you put vinegar in food. I mean, all right, pour some in. Wait, uh, wait don't you? I, I, it's also for cleaning. Okay then, but okay. Vinegar makes, uh, does it matter? Uh, baking soda first, because the vinegar is gonna fucking go down the drain. Right, then douse it with vinegar. The soda starts bubbling up, but the clog doesn't listen one bit. Well, we tried. I'll get you some rubber gloves. I'm the one who's gonna have to get in there. But of course, I am but a dainty little lady. You can't expect me to do a man's job. Fine. Just give me the gloves. Maybe the vinegar should have gone first. Got the rubber gloves. Nothing would have mattered. There you go. Have fun. And Andrew with the rubber gloves. He digs out God knows what out of the drain. Seemingly never ending amount of God knows what. Oh God, that's disgusting. Oh, I'm going to gag. You're not helping. Fuck, that is gross, Andy. And he doesn't respond to anything to that. Yeah, good, good. Looks like he's finally coming around. I don't think he's ever... Okay. Though there being no reaction at all is a little worrisome. The drain works. Let's get this over with. You and your brother dismember your parents. And disembowel them. And decapitate them. What fun! Uh... I can't say I didn't try. Can't say I didn't try. <sighs> oh my god. Jesus Christ. Having regrets? Would I be allowed to say so if I did? Jesus Christ. Of course, you could tell me anything. Anything I want used against me, anyway. Hey. I love you, Andy. I love you. I love you. I love you. I was I for dashing out earlier? I forgot how hard this is for you. I'm fine. No, you're not. Talk to me. What is he doing? No. No. Uh, no. Please don't. Andrew continues okay. butchering your parents. And for the first time forever, you have no idea what he's thinking. So what's the plan for all this? Where to dispose of it all. Yeah, but how? We'll use whatever means available in the house. Let's go. Let's look around and see what we can do. We need to make sulfuric acid in the bathtub. Oh my god. Okay. I don't know how I'm carrying all that, but okay. Functioning toilet. This mop is incredible! I don't like any of this. This is... <laughs> I... Uh, oh, I just want... I want to play happy games again. We can this burn game's... the bodies here. Hey, oh Colin. my god. Burn them! 
That would be like cremation. There's no way the temperature of the thing gets high enough. Oh, oh watch. Place the torso is above the fire. Andrew rolls his eyes, but the fire is lights before you. Well, would you look at that? Nothing is happening. Get rid of it, it. God damn it. This isn't working. Makes me kind of hungry, though. So, let's leave this be for now. Oh, God, they're going to eat their parents. You pour your parents are. Oh, my God. <laughs> I'm. Uh, 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 oh, God, it's gone. Oh, my God. In the blender. Uh, you I, thought you I didn't notice me. you put it in the blender. I thought you, you put it in the hands. No, I don't know. Throw them in the fireplace. And what about the skulls? Skulls we can deal with later, along with the other bones. Uh, I don't know. Let's turn the meat soap. Uh, I put some vegetables, maybe spices. Then throw the rest away. Scraps. What do you mean the rest? What do you think? I'm eating some. Do what you want. What was that soup you made earlier? And what were the ingredients again? The recipe is right there. Read it. Shame me for thinking you'd be helpful. It was meat, onions, potatoes, and carrots. Chop everything up and throw them into a pot. Ah, there we go. Thank you. I knew you memorized it. You fucking nerd. You're welcome. Okay. 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 Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Okay. Mm. Okay. Okay. I'm just click on everything, you know? It's just, there's no tub in here. No, there isn't. That was never an option. Onions, carrots. Oh my god. Potatoes. Inside. Outdoor. Down here. S soup. Lovely. What? Hmm. Meat, carrots, onion, potatoes. You chocolate. have to chop it on the chopping board, mate. Oh, I forgot to chop it. Yeah, you're right. Look at that. It's much better than your soup. Now, was there anything else we still need to deal with? The cooking meat over the fire that you're going to put in the soup? Base is in the fire. Do you think the soup is ready yet? What? Dinner's ready. I'm eating too. Of course, this is the last hearty home cooked meal for a while after all. You're really not going to have any. I honestly don't see the point. I hate everything about this. If you're hungry, there's other food available. Mm, but don't you want to feel powerful? Explain. Oh, well, let me think. Much, much. Okay, humans are top of the food chain, right? And then when I come and eat the humans, I'm on top of that. That's not really how it works, but whatever. Then this is your diet now. You sacrifice people and then eat them for kicks. Uh, you're not getting it. Let me try to explain it again. I don't need to get it. I just need to know if this is going to be a thing. I'm the one who's going to have to sort it out. It's like if I eat someone, I am eating their entire life so far. Like everything they've known and felt, I'm consuming all of it. If I could turn that into some sort of energy. I'd be all powerful. Does this power leave you leave as you shit out the corpses? <laughs> no, no. I'm absorbing nutrients. I get to keep this energy. If you say so. I'm not getting it at all. Even if I could magically absorb someone else's life, what would I do with that? I have no desire at all to be our mother or father in any capacity. Yeah. Well, those two I'm going to shit out and flush down the toilet. <laughs> ha. Holy fuck. Ha. Are there? And finally. Uh, nothing. Well, uh, anyway. I think we dealt with the flesh to the best of our abilities. But we still need to do something about the bones. Well, first of all, we need to ditch the leftover soup. While you do that, I'll clean the kitchen. Okay. <sighs> Go get rid of the bones. So that's you're gonna try to talk to yourself. Uh, right, wait, wait. Uh, what? <sighs> it should be fine. Just the chucks in the trash by the side, right? I mean, no, no. Pour it down the drain downstairs. Yeah. Why are we helping them get away with this? Because. All right, I can't. Flush down the toilet. Okay. Trash bin it is. 
This is so suspicious. Throw away the human leftovers. You're Andrew. Oh. I need to figure out what to do with all the bones. For now, I'll just collect them all before Ashley loses track of them. Uh huh. Got plastic bags. Okay, go get the bones. Go get the bones. They're in the basement. I think. Right I here. hope. Oh my gosh. The flesh is burned in the charcoal, but the bones mm. remain. Got bones. Put them in one of the plastic bags. Is there more bones downstairs? I think that was all of them. Oh. Uh, uh, so what do I do about these skulls? I'm thinking of throwing those into the ocean along with the rest of these bones. So much for making them disappear, huh? What did we do all this other crap for? Quiet you. As long as the teeth are removed, it should be fine. Oh my god! Based on what logic? The uh, dental records, I guess. You guess? How nice. Forgive me, oh beloved, for I have never gotten rid of a body before. I'm hoping one can identify someone based on their bones alone. Do bones float, though? Aren't they kind of like sticks? I'll find something to lay them down just in case. Okay. Uh. Got teeth. Got toothless skull. Got teeth. Uh. I have to find a way to get rid of them. No. Nah. So we lose the teeth, bag the bones with some rocks, call it a day. Got it. Uh, flush the teeth down the toilet. Okay. Oh, all gone. You wish you would do this all your problems. Yeah. Flush I don't it. like the thought of flushing more than 60 teeth down a toilet. Well, <laughs> they're gone. Uh, rocks. <sighs> Got rocks. Place them in the bag. I'm, okay. Ocean time, Ashley. Let's go, bitch. Oh, it means clean up the basement. Finally, all the remains. Stop! Oh, do we have to? Yes, obviously. <laughs> Why do we have to sacrifice someone again later anyway? Huh? Why do we have to do it here? Why do we have to be here? here? We just have to keep paying our pants rent or whatever. I wish he could, but I just someone is going to go. Hey, Mrs. Grace hasn't showed up to work in a while. So they get fired. So what? I doubt either of their bosses will care enough to file Mr. Parsons report. There's also the fact that they apparently mingled with the people here. The neighbors would notice them gone despite their name still being on the door. We can tell them some lies. Say they're house say we're house watching for our parents and so on. Listen, not everyone gives you a shits like you. They have coworkers, friends. Our other family besides us. What a bunch of whores. Why weren't they happy with just each other? <laughs> I didn't imply they fucked any of them. Irrelevant. It's what? all the same. Anyway. She has some kind of disorder and I don't know what it is. They can't all go. I haven't heard from those two in a while. Oh, well. Someone's going to go come looking with the authorities. And who will they find here? Their children. Who didn't report the parents missing? Officer asks, How the fuck aren't you dead anyway? If you don't want to stay here, just say so. It's not that. I don't want to. It I just think we I just don't think we can. We can at least use their IDs. Maybe we will be the new and improved Mr. and Mrs. Graves. We'd run into the same problem as with our, our own IDs. Once the authorities start looking for them, they'll see what we've been up to with the others. You with have theirs. their fucking credit card. Okay. Yeah. Sorry. <sighs> Sorry, Ashley. I wish this was that easy. Whatever. I'll clean the base with dead. Why? <gasps> I get to use the mop. God damn it. I really thought we were clear after all this. Ah, whatever. I'm going to need a mop. The ultimate god oh. mop. You got an excellent mop. Oh my god. Just cleaning up blood and some sick and nothing to worry about. Didn't happen. Should I put the candles back in the box too? Yes, you should. I'll take them with you. Yeah, for the next ritual. Yeah, exactly. And okay. Um, okay. Fingerprints all over the house. All done. Ready to go. I think so, though there's no way to tell if we missed out in Selfridgeville. Other than maybe see if you can have a dream where we're caught, I guess. I offer two souls, so it stands to reason that I have at least two visions to come. 
I'll right, take a nap and see if a disaster awaits us. Please do. Alright. So what are the conditions to get a vision? As in, what did the demon say about it exactly? Hell if I remember. You don't? Ugh. Could you possibly give it any less of a fuck? That'd be great. Oh, do forgive me, your highness. It's been a week or two. And up yours, you didn't even remember our parents' address. Which is, of course, just as important as this. Look, it just said that I need to hold on to it and have some clamor and dream. That's it. And it was in my pocket at the time when it happened. Then can I hold it this time? Nope. Oh, come on. Even if you had a vision, you'd just freak out and overthink it. Your dumbass can barely understand what's happening in the present, much less the future. If anyone should be deciphering what these dreams are about, it should be me. Screw you, now I'm definitely not letting me have it. Ugh, just fine. That was uncalled for. You're not getting my trigger. Fine, whatever. Have an awful night and terrible dreams. Andrew fucks off somewhere, you go to sleep. Oh god. Oh, this looks familiar-ish. The demon's summoning again? It did say it would. The door is hastily barricaded. Something tells you you should leave it be. Someone is at the door. Maybe I shouldn't stay here. Yeah, maybe she Alright. Get the flowers! Get the other petals! Before you go further! I wonder what's go. in there. Go! Go, Wesley, go! Your repressed memories, now go. Uh, we should totally let it happen, then. Oh, that's a good idea. Got next. Oh. Chop, chop, chop. Chop, chop, chop. Hang on, Divas, you fire up passing through right here. Dude. Do I use the wood? Do I fight with the axe? Oh, you, no, no, you just put the flowers down and run. Put the petals down and run. Do you I not have any more petals? Do I break something? Uh... I'll kill you with an axe! God, alright. Um... Um... The flower to the left? So go... Yeah, that. Can you not get to that? No, you can't. Okay. Let's see. Can you pick up the petals from the other side? No. Um... Maybe chop the grass? I'm clicking everything, buddy. Um... Oh, there we go. The roadside gets... I, I got a uh, roadside. Yeah. Like, Easy. I get... Bye! You kicked the roadside in the endless void. Fuck you. Bye! I win. I don't think you win yet. Oh my gosh. Do I guess? Did I fuck up? Yes. There's flowers right there. There's flowers right there. Next to the door frame. Oh, so there's. Park bench. La 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 la. This game's so fucked up, and I don't know why I keep playing it. Oh, I got it again. <laughs> okay. Yeah, then you pick it up Maybe. and put it. Yeah. Go that way. You give me that. And then you use it to get the flowers. Get this. On the other one. Here. And I get yeah. this one, this one, and this one, and this one, and then I take it back. I go up here. And then I take it yeah. back. And then I go, and you go here. down there. And then, take it back. and then you take it back. And, go, and you put that down. Boop, boop. And we're in. And then you smash the lock with the axe. I need the key over there. Just let me find some more flowers. There's no more flowers. Here's you've gone and fucked yourself. Oh, a key. What? Convenient. <laughs> what? Fucking what? What? Uh, My eyes can't handle this. Tiny tree. Left, up, left, up, left, up. I need. How do I do that? Okay, you got it. Got him. Got him. Got him. I got a white key. Got white key. Oh, so we need white door. Okay. Yeah. 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 No. Yeah. 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 White door. Oh. Yeah. 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 
Okay. in, please. <laughs> uh oh. Oh. Oh, it's just you. No, wait, something isn't. Um, I don't suppose we could talk things out. There, truce? Come on, Annie, play that with your sister. Uh oh. Tag. I'm it. You should run. Three? You should run. Two. One. Oh, oh, oh! What? No, it's not my fault! This episode is titled. What? No! Wait, 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 wait! Andy and Lele and. Now it's your way! The final finale, finally. No, I'm sorry, okay? We better just leave. Forget all about this. It's, everything will be just fine. I behave, I promise. You already showed me that's not true. I'm not falling for this again. No, 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 no. Wait, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Andrew. I'm sorry. I'm so tired of your sorries. They don't mean shit. You fucked. Oof. Shit, shit. No, 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 no. I don't want to piss him off like that. I would Andy ever. No, he would never. Not my Andy. No, I suppose he might. Or Andrew might anyway. It's him less and less and less. Everything okay with you? Uh, oh, I guess I had a nightmare. A vision? No! Uh, no, no, it was like vague nonsense. Okay. Hey, Andy. Please be Andy. Please be Andy. Please be Andy, please. What is it? Nothing, fuck. Nothing, nothing, never mind. I just love you so much. Thanks. Jesus, what a shit reply as usual. I'm gonna kill you to just say a bad day every once in a while. You keep calling me by some other guy's name. What do you expect? Come on, then. Our parents won't jump in the ocean by themselves. Oof. Oh, oof. Yum, bum, 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 bum. Out the front door, super suspicious. And I'm going to the store to kill my parrot and your... You already killed your parents. Kill your... Oh. Oh. That <laughs> Whoops. Are you picking them up or what? Hey now, I wasn't the one who packed them in this flimsy bag. I say pick them up, you dumb bitch. Why did you just call me? Now, Ashley. All right, all right. Got him. Thank God no one is here at this hour. And that's when we find out something was here at this hour. Vroom, vroom. It's a dog. Okay, night. so don't stray too far into the light. Just in case someone does pass by. Okay, then. Andrew drops the bag with the bones and rocks into the ocean. What about the skulls since they're no longer in a bag? Whatever, chuck them. If you say so. Well, then, my congratulations for your loss. Very clever. What is it? Nothing. So what do you do now? Whatever you want. Oh, well, this is new. How come? Well, I'm doing whatever you want anyway. Why even ask me? Are you uh, mad at me? Nah. What did you want to do, Ashley? I want to do what you want to do. Want to turn ourselves in then? Well, not that. What the hell? So much for my opinion. Not that I was serious. You're totally mad at me, Andy. Why? Remember when you promised you wouldn't call me that anymore? Nope, but I remember half a minute ago when you said we well, do what I want. You're really going to treat me this way after I've just after all I've just done for you. So you are mad at me. I fucking knew it. I asked you for one thing, Ashley. One. Not that big not a big thing, mind you. Not even a difficult one. Yeah, I'm mad. But so what? It's not like, it's not as if you're going to do anything about it. Just pick the next stupid thing you want to do and let's go. You're fine with me calling you Andy back at the house yesterday. I had to be, didn't I? 
you knew I couldn't afford to start a fight with you then. That's why you started pushing for it. You think you didn't? You think I didn't pick up on that? Well, this neither appearances is to keep nor corpses to hide now. Do you want to have another go at it? Well, what would you want, Andrew? I don't like this. Sigh. I want to lock you in the trunk of the car and drive off this bridge. <laughs> ha ha ha. You think I'm kidding? Yeah, I don't want to be in a scene grave as mom and dad. And spare me the spare me half the fucking respect I gave you. I will. Right after you love me with the same half heart I love you with, asshole. Say, how exactly is irritating me supposed to inspire tenderness? It's complicated. I'm a very complex person like that. The hell you are, you absolute simpleton. I'm so simple. How come you can't keep up? I have to be stupid to understand the thoughts of the stupids. Arrogant prick, get over yourself. Maybe later. Meanwhile, you should get in the car. We're out of here. Oh, where are we going? The bottom of the ocean, dumbass. You already told you. I don't know yet, but I want to leave before the corpses float up or something. I wonder if we're fine now. Yeah, it's probably fine. Mm hmm. End of episode two. Say the game. Yes. Yeah. You can continue here once episode three decay has been updated. Oh, well, that's all it's here now. Yep. I guess we're all caught up then. Holy shit. Uh, my God. Um, this has been an experience so far. I didn't think the game wasn't finished. Oh, well. Wow. Holy shit. Yeah. We'll pick this up whenever the next part is released, I guess. Yeah. Uh, next time. Whenever that will be. Yep. Bye-bye.